My name is Robert Bonavito, New Jersey Forensic Accountant. This video is part of a series of videos where I discuss forensic accounting topics for educational purposes only. If this was a litigated matter, I would take a different approach, have different conclusions based on different facts and circumstances. Hi, my name is Robert Bonavito, New Jersey Forensic Accountant. Um, we do a lot of appraisals and valuations in our firm, and uh, I'm often asked, you know, how do we analyze the businesses that we look at? And what we use is, we use a technique called um, the business model canvas. And what the business model canvas is, it's basically nine key areas that every business should know about themselves. And what we do is we write the nine areas, and I have them here, which the nine areas that we look at are key partners, key activities, value proposition, relationships, customer segment, key resources, channels, revenue stream, and cost structure. And after we line these up on a canvas, we would write down what's, who their key partners are, who their key activities are. And when we go through this exercise, it's a great way uh, for us to understand the story of the company, to understand the narrative of the company. And it, it, this is basically a company in a nutshell. And I'm going to go through a quick example here. Let's say we're doing a valuation on Facebook. And, um, you know, I want to get a better understanding of the business. What would the, who would their key partners be? Well, it would be uh, content providers, right? I mean, that, that is a key partner. Um, TV shows, music, articles, you know, you go on Facebook, you see that type of stuff. Key activities. What do you think the key activity in Facebook is? Well, it's their, it's their, their uh, platform development, correct? I mean, let's face it, if you went on Facebook and it didn't work, you would never use it. That is a key activity, is to make sure they have a, a, a really good uh, uh, platform. Uh, value proposition. What is their value proposition, right? Well, most people go on there to contact with friends and family, right? That's why you go on there. So it's important to understand what the value prop relationships, who they have relationships with, right? Well, they have relationships with suppliers, they have relationships with uh, uh, advertisers, they have relationships with uh, the actual people using um, Facebook. What's their cu customer segment? They have internet users, advertisers, marketers, and developers, a couple of them. Um, key resources would be, again, the, 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 the platform, again, the programming and all that is a key resource to them. That is their, their most key resource, because like I said, if you go on Facebook and it's not working, you can't use it. If you go on a couple times and it's not working, you'll never use it. Um, let's see, channels, okay. Basically, websites, apps, right? Your phone app, the revenue stream. It's free, right? For, for most of us, it's free. But uh, advertisers and uh, vendors have to pay for that. Uh, but, but basically, most people don't pay anything for Facebook, and that's why they like it. Uh, cost structure. What's their biggest cost? The biggest cost is, is the, uh, you know, maintaining uh, the data centers general administration expenses, that type of stuff. What's their re revenue stream? Again, that's free. Um, and so when you go through and uh, think about this, uh, uh, you know, uh, canvas, you should have, when you put this up, you could, you could put this up in your office and have all, all nine key areas with, you know, your key partners, your value propositions, I think you're going to have a really good understanding of your business. And for a business appraisal like we are, we, ha we have a great understanding of the business we're appraising. My name is Robert Bonavito. If you have any questions, feel free to email me.